another thing that's miscommunicated or not communicated well, perhaps I think, is that uh, like how it, how the economy works with side chains. So the key to remember is that while it's possible, the utility on the side chains doesn't require a new token. Um, so true again. There's a, there's a little asterisk there because I don't know what people are going to make with sidechains. So maybe it will. But the, the key part are for Divi sidechains is that when you go to utilize the, the actual services on those sidechains, the, the utility that you're seeking, you're going to pay for that utility with Divi. Um, and so that's how that works. The Divi will enter those sidechains. Uh, when you pay for the service that you want on those sidechains, uh, what you pay is what's getting split up amongst the um the validators on that side chain and the validators will receive some or all of the of those fees that's that's uh, you using divi to get the services and, and be granted the utility that you Correct. want that's the economy happening there we need to have it, it, it is if we do <laughs> i'll use a curse word no i'm kidding um it is Ethereum is a gas. Ethereum is the engine. Ethereum is the coin that's produced, at least originally by proof of work and now by the proof of stake, which is very different, by the way. Don't get me on that one. It's very different from what you do as a vault or a solo validator on Divi. Um, those coins are then used in the system to do things, not originally as Vitalik intended. Uh, he didn't intend it to become a, a coin per se as a value transfer. He intended it to be the mechanism, as he stated, gas for the network. We intend for both. Divi can be used for utility, but Divi can also be used for whatever you dream it to be used for. If you dream that you want to use your Divi to be able to buy uh, uh, whatever you want to be able to buy with it, that's totally entirely up to you. We want it to be as flexible and usable as absolutely possible. It just also happens to be the engine, the gas, if we dare say it, that drives the side chains. That's right. And so, so I think that's, that's a full understanding on how fees and how Divi is used to get the utility and grant utility to Divi. I think so. Yeah. And I mean, in a way, right, I understand it's very complicated because as you just mentioned earlier, everything is possible. So obviously there is, <laughs> there is a direction that DV will focus on and obviously this is DV utility. But at the end of the day, anyone could deploy a sidechain and uh, not use DV or use, decide to use another asset or even not connect could, to yes. DV, right? So um, it, it is, in a way for me, it's what makes it the best option, right? It's not, it's not something that is uh, limited to Divi. It's actually fully open. Um, so it will, be, it will be our role to make sure that um, Divi remains a critical point in, in those development. And Correct. again, like we will come with those you know, sidechain themes where people will be able to deploy their service. And, and obviously that framework will be using Divi. So, as you can see right now, in most of the smart contracts and and other things that people just copy paste, um, they don't change that, right? They don't go and take the time to change the currency, and it will benefit DV two. That's uh, that's almost sure. Correct. Correct. Yeah.